Hey guys, welcome to another technical video. In this one, I'm just quickly gonna show you how you can collect email addresses inside of your email integration software. However, you can use GrooveMail, but uh, for the initial stages, uh, in case you would want to uh, know how you can add an integration for an external integration to your mailing, and you would want to use the Mailchimp account or the Gate Response account, how you can connect it with your page. So for this example, I'm gonna use a. Uh, a uh, lead magnet funnel or a uh, lead generation funnel this is a lead generation funnel a simple page that i had built to give away a free membership funnel template so what i'm gonna do over here is uh, let's say we do not have this okay so what we will be doing is we will head on to blog section and then we will go to this section uh, called forms and then we will be choosing one random one and then we will be pasting it over here what we want to do over here is we just want this section of email okay the whole section so we will be clicking on the anywhere in between the whole thing so this whole section selects up and then we'll click on this we want to get the whole thing so yes so now we select the whole thing and we paste it right here okay now we, let me just quickly delete this section okay no, we don't want this. Let's just assume it's not even here. Okay. So, as you can see, here the name will be showing up. We'll go to configure. And then here the first name. So, we'll type in F name. F name. And then over here it's showing uh, name. So, we'll click on add validation. It has to be filled up. So, it cannot be empty. Then we'll do the same with email. Here we'll put email in small letters. Then we'll add validations. It cannot be put to neck empty. And then we'll select email. Then we'll click on update. Now over here we'll be changing the design as well for this. Uh, change the background to black to match our link. We'll change it to white. Then we'll change the font. To Lato, we will change the name over here. Uh, send me the template or take me to to the template. Okay, so and let this be submit. Okay, click on update, and over here we will be checking okay so we'll click on save now we will be integrating it with mailchimp so we will click on the center and we'll head on to configure then as you can see we have integration over here now in case you wouldn't have any integration so what we will be doing is we will be heading on to my integration i have already added you can click on add integration type you can choose mailchimp get response or whatever you have over here it keeps on updating so don't um so whatever you are seeing you can add it right here in the integration section so right now i'll be showing you how you can connect mailchimp so you click on mailchimp give it a name let's say it's for from my main account digim is mailchimp since i don't use a pro version of mailchimp uh this is what it's gonna look like let me quickly go to mailchimp dashboard so in the dashboard section we will be going to uh, click on the profile and then we'll head on to uh, account i'm sorry we'll head on to account and then in the account section we will head on to extras api keys now over here in the api keys we will scroll down and click on create a key now as soon as we click on create a key a new key will be generated and we can copy the key just like this and we will coming back over here and paste it okay now it gets added we click on update this will be added we do not want this to add so i will be deleting it now once you have added it come back over here click on the center click on configuration integration then click on your integration name mine has been already selected then click the list you would want people to get into you can create the list inside of mailchimp so once you have created the list you can connect the list here and then we will be heading people to the url 
membership funnel URL that I have set. So we click on update, we click on save, then we will hit the publish button. So that's all. This is how you can connect your MailChimp and start getting leads. Now, as soon as somebody fills in the form over here, you will be getting their email address and their name inside of your MailChimp account. So that will be all for this video and I will be seeing you in the next one.